Walk on on back of one ever egg give me good another sound episode with more Paper Mario color splash on the Nintendo Wii U and welcome to it So last time because uh, we have a journey to the Indigo underground Just to, so that we we go out exploring fighting several of the enemies and rescue one of the um, the, the rescue squads with our uh, green toes and we're gonna make the most of it so this uh, toad is uh, having trouble of sucking up because it can't make a neat bridge for us so now the best way to to help this toad out is to is to go back up to the uh, surface and go in and help him out I mean for they, they just can't take it anymore well you can barely saw how silly of this game looks and this uh, in this tip of the mechanic so we're only allowed to, to pull this. Maya, our depth to you are really starting to stack up. Squatty number three, Sitcha. Maya, sin okay, what is that word? Sinusis, okay, so my sinusis are, are on fire, sir, but I'll be okay. It'll take a more than a physical force to break out a bond of unity. All right, Mario, please proceed. Okay, so we can proceed with our uh, cautious. And these uh, rescue told us, saying, "Ow, that, that hurt. I mean, they can't take away. They can't take anymore with that pain." <laughs> okay, so this a new, So what's this card we got? Okay, so we get here is another line jump, which we can go ahead and line up a jump if you needed to. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and wait for this. So let's go ahead and move downward, and this uh, pressure platform go ahead and pushing me upward. So that way we get across to, to to go through to the tow bridge. And yeah, before moving on, so there is this a uh, lemon we're looking at here. So that lemon looked like the uh, mechanic that the, the graphic looked exactly like it from uh, from Pitman Free. I'm assuming. Okay, so uh, let's get all of these coins up and move on. Okay, so so these shy guys over there are trying to suck up the the lemon. Which it looked to be like they, they, so they wanted to use their straw so that way they can go and taste to see how tastier the lemon tastes like. Okay, so we'll go ahead and use the, the line jump. So we'll go use that in battle if we have to. Okay, so that's two of these that shake up a move. Alright, so we get to the go move forward. I right, and go pick up another red slurp guy. So that red slurp guy is a new card that we pick up. Okay, so we got here the regular hammer and we'll go and squeeze this. So we're making this a limit on new card. Okay, so just squeezing down all of this a limit pretty good. Okay, so adds a little zest to any meal. Interesting, alright. Now moving through, so there is a second of this of this mini pink storm we need to go after, so let's go and grab it. Okay, so we go clear one of this course. Alright, so we get all of the we get all of this free money and everything. Alright, so we can get all of that. And I do believe this go and take us back to back to where we are. Okay, so let's go clear uh, a path for us. Okay, and we got it, uh, some new mail available. Okay, so a letter had arrived in Port Prisma. All right, well, can't wait to check it out later. Okay, so it seems like that we can't go to that yet. Okay, so we already 94% the, the the Blue Bay Beach and 94% the Indigo Underground. So we need to, to like go all around these uh these worlds and just getting everything done by 100 percent yeah because there are some of these uh, spots that we're missing here so yeah because we're gonna make the most of it all right because we had to go and explore many worlds and and see what needed to be done but painting around here so um i'm a, i think we should go ahead and start somewhere back at blue bay and try to see if we can get everything painted in 100 percent so um yeah, let me see you from the start as we split a cut. Okay, now moving this back to here because there's something else that we're missing around here. So, you know what? This is the path that I'm missing because it's a turn out because it was um, kind of tricky actually a little bit because it's uh, something that I I wouldn't have spent to find out where Sword and Rose hidden white spots are. So, how on earth are we supposed to get this toe out of the, uh, the shower? 
Um, okay, but <laughs> that seemed kind of awkward. Okay, so we have to go and use cutout technique to, to get the toe out of there. Okay, so let's go do that. So we'll go cut it in square. Okay, and yes, yeah, so so we, we spotted with it to define Luigi in Blue Bay. Okay, so there was a Luigi hiding in the bathroom and it just ran away. Okay, <laughs> dang. That is pretty crazy. Was that a green Mario Kart player? That must be weird for you. Well, technically, that was a Luigi we spotted witness on. So, uh, let's go to the uh, open menu and see if we got everything on 100%. So, so uh, look at that stasis over here. Okay, so we cleared about only 98% of it. So, we'll try to make the most of it because we need to get everything in by 100%. I mean, there's uh, more to, to places to come around here. So, um, let's look for that last spot somewhere. So, uh, be right back. Okay, so I think you were supposed to paint this. You paint the stairs and then go get the block. So, let's see what we get inside. A hot slipper? Alright, so open up to the menu. So, um, let's see. But we, have we established? Okay, no. Nah, I mean, we, we still got coloration on 98%. Okay, so... Now, still, we're trying to look for that last spot somewhere which is just kind of tricky and all. So um, let's uh, go back and do another split and I'll see if I can find out where that last one is. So I'll be right back. Oh, you know what? This should be the last one. The last one gets kind of tricky. Okay. So uh, we got the last one. And now I think we are ready to to move out of here. So let's see. Um, take a look at Stacy over here. Okay, so we got Blue Bay Beach on 100%. Not bad. So we're going to make the most of it. So we're going to try to see if we can get everything in uh, a complete around here and by 100% I mean there's a uh, more two other chances to go around here in uh, every other world so without further ado let's go ahead and sell out to to see what need to be done around here so uh, no uh, we're not going that way so what do we need to need to get done around here and by 100% okay so these are want to be those uh, purple rescue team squad that we we gotta wait for later I mean we have not figured out where the last one is so ready row will have to come out what what will have to to come soon last. Okay, now I really do think that we should go ahead and take on the and then go underground and get that done in one by one hundred percent. So um let's go and get that done in in a split and a cut. Okay, so one thing that's missing here is uh this spot over here. It's this that spot that we're missing because uh, we just uh, go right after the uh, the second mini paint star, which is on blue. So we'll go ahead and peel the sticker off with say Bowser. And I think that so this go and take us back to this yellow mini paint star where we left off. Okay, well not so fast. I mean, there's still one more thing that we're missing here. So uh, let's just hope we're not missing any everything around here. So it seems to me because we already been to this spot already and gotten the the second of the blue mini pin star okay let me go look at the um the, my uh, stasis stasis real quick so we got it on 97 percent which is wasn't too bad actually because we are missing one more problem and it's the last of this uh, indingo we need to go at no no not indingo it's the last of this uh, white spot we need to go after so Let's just figure out where that last one is, and I will see you back. Alright, so you know what? I really think we should go and grab the mini paint star and come back to and then go underground later, because I'm not seeing any of those white spots activity around here. I would have been keeping my eye distant to the check the, uh, my uh, surrounding to see where the last one is, because it gets kind of tricky, because finding all of these uh, white spots that are not in full color gets kind of tricky and all. So uh, what is this uh, new map we unlock here? Okay, well that looks kind of new actually. Just I couldn't wait to check it out. So uh, what is this next stage? Okay, so this one is called the 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 Defoli the the Fottle Peak. It's what it's called. Okay. Now that's something we can wait for later. Right now, I really need to get tracking down to find out where the last the, the last of this uh, color spot is. So uh, let's go back uh, again and figure out where the last one can be hiding. So uh, be right back. 
Oh, wait, wait. It was right underneath Bear. Oh my gosh. That is so tricky. That is so darn tricky. Oh my gosh. Now let's go over the menu real quick. Thank you. Oh my gosh. That last one is so tricky. I just can't figure out the um, the problem to the solution to all, all of these obstacles and enemies and everything. But dang, that is so tricky. Because that last one I couldn't find it was so tricky. It was um, it was now let me tell you this, you guys. And going to Indango Underground was not going to be pretty easy because tracking down to find all of these colorless spots. Well, um, we're going to call them colorless spots because both were one of the um, the, the colors that we have uh, not fully filled in in full color. I mean, because uh, we, we saw what's beneath white because that's not in full color. So we want to go back to Port Prisma and, and see what's new on the mail. So we go open this and check in with the, the mail toad. And we go and approach. Hey Mario, great timing. You got new mail. Alright, what we got? Mr. Mario, thank you for showing me that your illustrious card collection the other day. Since you possess such a magnificent collection, I was wondering if you might help me out there with something. I await you in the Ashen Command Dojo in the Yellow District. The are the card called Noisia Toad. And here's another new letter for you, I said. Hey, big bro. It's a Luigi again. You know, your brother with the owl on his hat. You ever read the A V explanation on the A your thing cards? I know you are not uh, the type of to read directions, but uh, you might uh, find a hint about the when to use them. Remember, you can always uh, reread the old letters. Just open the menu, tap items, and yeah, 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 we we understand. Okay, so um, it seems like that we got uh, two new letters available at the Port Prisma. So uh, I want to go ahead and double check and explore the place uh, a bit by bit and. Port Prisma a little bit. Now there's something else to just go around here just to seek out what we might be doing around here because it just seems like that I have not witnessed the spot on because uh, because I have not seen any of these uh, new color colorless spots available. Now let's go check in and we go open this. Okay, so I yeah, so this is the um, the, the guy with the uh, glasses. Oh, uh, Mr. Mario, how splendid that you have a good sense to entertain uh, my offer. Follow me, please. Come this way. Oh, uh, wait, a secret door? What's with all of this uh, high-tech stuff that's just uh, sitting around in a crummy storage room? This is weird, Mario, but I'm thinking it could be good or weird. Uh, let's check it out. Ah, uh, yes, well, let's indeed do. Check this place out. Okay, so where are we at now? I spent long years of my life at designing and constructing this place in order to document the history, history and culture of Prism Island. Welcome, my friend, to a little place that I like to call... Prisma Museum. An underground museum? This must be the one of those super snobby art places that no one knows about. Oh, Couture! My friend, my mission is to make our collection as accessible as possible. Even a common uh, undergraduate art student should be able to appreciate it. There's uh, just a one tiny thing I don't actually have anything to display of, of yet. And having uh, seen your collection of battle cards, my dear Mario, I feel we would be in a rather good hand if you choose uh, to donate. Sound like, it's, uh, for, sound like it's, it's for a good cause. Plus, the Point Prisma is in my hometown. It'll be a nice to visit the museum when I'm old and remedy about our adventure. Splendid. I knew I could have on someone with such a fine taste in battle cards. With that, uh, please allow me to give you the grand tour. The three blue doors in front of you are card galleries display, displaying the battle cards. From left to right, the blue door contains the basic card, enemy cards, and thing cards. If you have a card that you can donate to a room, but the star above the door will light up. To donate a card, simply enter via the room and follow the toad's instructions. Moving on to the red door to the left that leads to the art exhibit. But the more cards you donate, the more pieces you will be able to add to each exhibit. Finally, the green door to the right that leads to the sound exhibit. You'll be able to populate it with sound by completing the repainting the courses. After the guy told in the 
in the each exhibit for more information or ask me if you would like to know about the state of the overall collection. I can't offend you enough for your assistance. Take care. My my, you have been a busy with the other old Penta Hammer, haven't you? Well, don't think that we haven't noticed. Thanks to your fine effort, we've been able to procure some records for the sound gallery. Alright, well, let's go check it out. So, we'll go ahead and check out this next door on the right, in the middle. So, uh, check it out with this total over here. So, welcome, Mario. This is the enemy card gallery. We display cards that you get them from defeating, defeating enemies. Cards that you donate can be a view on the big display in the center. We really appreciate you helping us out with the museum. Here are the cards you can donate from your current inventory. Okay, so you know what? I can donate whatever card I like. Okay, cool. Well, at least uh, I, I, I can't go donate any card right now. We look forward to your next visit. Okay, so it's still like that we can go and explore in different places and seeking out to to define what's new around here. Wh whichever card we can go donate. Okay, so what's this here again? This is a basic card gallery. We display basic battle cards and such as Johnson Hammer cards. Cards that you donate can be a view on the big display in the center. We really appreciate you helping us out with the museum. Here are the cards you can donate from your current inventory. Okay, so let me go ahead and check in with my uh, gamepad real quick. So, it does seem like to me because I can donate it is a whole bunch of everything. So, hold on a minute. No, no, hold on. I don't want it to donate that. But you know what? How about you donate the fire flower? Okay, so we can go cancel this. Thank for your donation. We really appreciate the help. Okay, now that's one of this uh, donation that we did establish here. So we go and open up this. Okay, so let's go check in. So yeah, well we don't have that. We, we don't have that yet. Okay, so um, let's go talk to this purple toad over here. So we want to go ahead and make some more donation to this museum. So let's see what we got to manage. So you know what? I'm gonna have this uh, fan go to donation. Okay, so we can cancel that with B. Thank for your donation. We really appreciate the help. Okay, so we check it again. Okay, so we have this new gallery called the fan. Well, I, I won't explain the, the details about it right now. Okay, so we'll go open this. And you know what I do have here is uh, one of this uh, shy guy. I, I do have two of the shy guys. So um, hold on. Now let me go ask you. So I want you to go donate two of my shy guys. Okay, so you can donate to the one which have the the straw on it. Okay, so we'll go cancel this. And we will be done for the day. Alright. So that's all the free of my uh, donation I want to go and get rid of. Now, can we go and check this place out? So let's go open this. So, so uh, where is this place at? Okay, so what what appear to be over here? So let's talk to this toad. Welcome to the Prince Art Gallery. We're able to acquire more art pieces that you will donate cards, so please don't be stingy. You can use this at the play to look at the artwork more closely. Thank you for your help. I'm um, okay, well... So it seems to me because uh, one of these uh, art gallery weren't available just yet. Ah, uh, okay, well, it's available at next time. Okay, so we, we should check out the, uh, the next door on the right. So the door that we see is, um, this next exhibit is on the right. Now let's go and check this place out. Now, what is this place anyway? Welcome, this is the sound gallery. Each time you find, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, each time you finish completely uh, repainting with a color response and a, a color that we're able to, to get our hands on more priceless r recordings. Please use the screen if you would like to, to listen to one of the records. Thank you for your help in, in discovering these records. Um, okay, cool stuff, cool stuff, alright. 
Well, you know what? Now, there's no, no telling if we're able to uh, actually, you know what? If we go ahead and check this. So, we're looking at the gamepad. So, we can go ahead and listen to the Cherry Lake as, we, as I go and press on it. So, we can go listen to Cherry Lake right now. Okay, it just go ahead and play the sound. Okay, so we can listen to the number one thing squeezer. And the cut out for the cut out. So, we go listen to it carefully. And the power of the chosen. Okay, so those are three other soundtracks that we can go listen to. Alright, well that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Alright. So it seems like that we can go ahead and listen to every other soundtrack by 100% of getting everything done around here. Alright, well that explains a lot about everything. So we can move out of here. And, and of course, uh, this is where we go and move out of the uh, museum. So we'll move out of the, uh, the, the, the the dojo, not to mention to say action command out loud. But uh, yeah, I think that's something about everything. So I do believe that's going to be all it, you guys. So next time on Paper Mario Color Splash, we are going to be setting out in the, uh, the big world of the map. And seeking out what we need to be doing around here. But just to go and explore everything around here in Prism Island. Of just to seek it out to find more and more of these uh, toes available and... Getting all of these uh, colorless, colorless spot done and by 100%. So uh, we'll go ahead and make the most of it and we go back into into every other world of just seeking out what needs to be done around here by just uh, finding more of these uh, mini paint stars. And that's something we can get started on doing things next on the, on the next series, you guys. So you don't go anywhere and you will be particular and stay tuned on the next series. So thank you guys so much for taking the time to tune in and watch this episode. So if you like the series and you want to see more of Paper Mario Color Splash, be sure to leave an advertise a like, share the video, and subscribe. And if you do subscribe, run the notification bell so that you'll, you'll be stay up to notified when my news and awesome videos have it underway. So that's going to be all it for Paper Mario Color Splash. We'll be picking up on the next one. So take care, guys. I hope to talk to you on the next video. Thank you